I'm the king of the world. I feel like I'm so special and important. I just feel amazing. I feel like everything revolves around me. I am the king of the world. I can do anything I want. I feel so special and unique, man. How come everyone else is a loser? I'm, I'm the king of the world and this stuff. I'm on top of everything, man. I feel so great. Damn. Oh, but I'm worried that other people might think bad of me. I gotta keep up my image and stuff like this. I gotta make sure I'm carefully taking care of my appearance and exercising and eating right so I don't turn into some slob and so people won't lose respect for me. I am the king of the world so everyone cares about what I do and what I think and stuff and how I look like and stuff. I have to make sure I'm super clean and tidy and etc. I'm the king of the world and stuff. Surely you can't be this delusional to think that you're the king of the world and that you're so special and important and that people care about you in any meaningful way. Surely you have to realize and understand that you're just any other type of person. You're not special or unique. You're just another type of person. We all have our own individual lives. We all have our own problems and issues and stuff that we have to deal with. We're, we all, we, we're all just obsessed with ourselves. We like you're, you're not the king of the world. You're just another person, just like anybody else. You're just another person, just like most people. You think that you're so important and special that other people care about you, but that's not true. Other people are more concerned about themselves, just like how you only care about your own interests and stuff in your own life. So too do other people. Other people only care about their own lives and stuff. They don't care about you. Just like how you don't care about other people or think about other people, you just think about your own life and problems and issues. Likewise, most other people, they think about their own lives and things like that. You're not the king of the world, you're just another person. I feel so special and important. I feel like I'm on top of everything. I am the king of the world. I deserve special treatment. I better make sure I'm taking care of my appearance so nobody loses respect for me. But then you see, that's the point. You're not the king of the world. Nobody cares about you. You're not special or important. This type of narcissism is kind of ridiculous. This egocentrism and stuff like that. You cannot be this delusional. Your appearance does not matter to most people. Most people just don't even look twice at you when you're walking down the street. Nobody truly cares about you. You have to understand that you're not that special or unique. You're not that important. You're just another person, just like everybody else. But I am the king of the world. I feel like I'm so important and special. I have severe anxiety because I believe that other people care about what I do and stuff and how I look like. That's why I have to spend hours meticulously taking care of my appearance so other people don't lose respect for me and stuff. I, I know I'm this important and special. I am the king of the world, so I have to keep my appearance looking sharp. I have to make sure that I'm doing everything right. Everybody cares about me. I am super special and important and stuff. I have to make sure everything I do is proper and stuff and I don't kind of become lazy or any, or kind of, you know, become kind of, um, kind of a slob and stuff. And so people, they would lose respect for me if I, if I, you know, if I stop taking care of my parents, I have to make sure that never happens. I have to always take care of my parents. But surely, you know, that nobody cares about you. You're not the king of the world. You're not that special or important. You're suffering from narcissism, which is, I mean, most people suffer from narcissism. Most people have massive egos. They cannot, they, they cannot imagine themselves to, to, to be just ordinary people. They have to see themselves as being special. But you have to understand you're not special. You're just another person, another individual with his own problems in life. Most other people, they're just like you. They have their own lives and problems and issues. You're not special. You're just another individual, another person. All right, big Sonic. Thanks for your contributions to this discussion, but I, I, I don't like you now. Why is that, small Sonic? You said you're saying I'm not special. No, you, you, yeah, but that is kind of true. You're just another individual in person. I don't know. Maybe you might be special in some other type of way, but you cannot have this massive ego and think that everything you do is super important. We're literally. In terms of like the entire universe, we're literally just dust. We're, li we're little tiny microscopic bacteria. Have some humility. Okay, Big Sonic. Thank you again for your contributions to this discussion. No problem, Small Sonic.
You're not special. All right, this video is kind of, this is like, what, 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 what am I getting at? You're not special. Okay, is it, what, what, what do you mean? What, what am I getting at here? Because this video is going to be about, about the fact that you're not special and stuff. What do I mean by this? A lot of people are going to get kind of contentious and stuff like that. But what do I, what, okay, first of all, what do I, what do I even mean by you're not special? That, that, like, you're not special, which, which means that, um, like the world doesn't really care about you in any meaningful way. This is something that you must understand when you're, especially when you're very young. If you're still young, maybe you might be kind of old now, but I don't know. You got, you must understand this, right? That the world doesn't really care about you in any meaningful way. You know what I mean? It, it feels as if like we have like this type of spotlight on us at all times. Well, this massive spotlight that everything we do is so important. Everything we do is like, it has like massive consequences and stuff like that. There's like this huge spotlight and everybody around the world cares about us and stuff. And you know, we're the kings and queens of the world. This is um nonsense, right? This is nonsense. In real life, there is no spotlight. The world doesn't really care about you at all and stuff like that. You're literally, you're so irrelevant, right? That if you died tomorrow, I mean, your family are gonna be sad, but like a lot of them, like the, the majority, the majority of uh, humanity is not gonna even cry. The majority of humanity is not even gonna shed a tear or care about your death. Think about that. That's very important. If you died today, nobody's gonna care about you tomorrow. It, it, obviously, your family and people and close people around you, but the, m m m a lot of humanity is not gonna care about you. The majority of humanity is not gonna even shed a tear for you and stuff. Which is kind of, you know, you're not special. The world doesn't really care about you. That's so important. That's something you must understand, right? It feels like at all times we have like a spotlight that's following us around. We're like on a stage and everyone's looking at us and paying attention and judging us and stuff like this. This is, um, this is complete nonsense. This is, um, this is delusional. This is, um, ridiculous and stuff. The, the, the reality is that nobody cares about us. We're not special. Us individuals, we're not important or special or anything like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's something you have to understand. It feels like the world cares about us. Everyone around the world is looking at us. We're on a stage. Everyone's meticulously judging us and and stuff like that and assessing us and stuff and carefully looking at us and paying attention to everything we do. This is delusional. This is ridiculous. The world doesn't care about us. You're not special. I'm not special. As individuals, we're not special and stuff. This is something you have to understand. You have to, you must grasp this. It's so important to understand and grasp this that you are not special in any meaningful way. The, the world doesn't care about you, man. What, do I, what, what, what am I getting at again? A lot of people say, well, okay, the world doesn't care about me, but, but my family does and stuff like that, my closest friends and stuff like this. So I, I'm special in that type of way. Okay, but you know, typically, when people, like typically it feels, especially when you're very young and stuff, it feels like you, you're on a stage and there's a spotlight on you and everyone's judging you and assessing you and paying attention to you and care and like caref care carefully looking at you and focusing on you and stuff like this and and there and people are always thinking about you this is like when especially if you're like a young teenager this is like something that you might kind of think about and this is like the type of mentality you might have that, 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 that you might think that other people care about you to this ex extent but you know it's kind of the truth is the reality is you're not special the world doesn't care about you if you died tomorrow, only your like your mother and father are gonna cry, obviously, and maybe other family members and close associates and friends and stuff. But the, again, the majority of humanity won't even shed a tear for your death. That's something you gotta really think about, and you know, because you're not special. Again, because especially when you're young, you, you you feel like you're on a stage and everyone's kind of judging you and assessing you and carefully like thinking about you and focusing on you and stuff like this but you know again the, the reality is you're not special the world doesn't care about you in in real life there is no spotlight you're not on you're, there is no stage for you to get on you're not that important in any way well okay but what, what, what if i turn into a celebrity then a lot of people are going to care about me okay and that's kind of very different what if i well, what if i work really hard and become successful in some type of um in some type of um endeavor and stuff and people they pay attention to me okay but you know, even these celebrities, actually maybe depending on the celebrity, I mean, Justin Bieber and stuff like that, he probably he probably gets harassed everywhere, I don't know. But even these celebrities, like they're just, I mean, obviously people care about them and stuff like this, and, and they do get noticed and recognized a lot. But you know, most, like a lot of us, we don't really think about these celebrities too much, right? You don't, like Justin Bieber, do you think about him all day? Is he in your head all day? 
You know what I mean? Did you think about him all day? Of course you don't think about Justin Bieber all day. You just, you may, you might come across his music and something, you might have an idea of who he is, but you don't think about him all day. You know, it's like even these celebrities, they're not that special, right? Although obviously a celebrity, you know, there's a reason we call celebrities celebrities there. They are um, a little bit different from us ord ordinary folk. You know, but you know, you don't think about Justin Bieber all day, or what, or you might be more familiar with someone else, some other type of celebrity. You don't think about that particular celebrity all day. So even these celebrities, they're not that special or important. Obviously, they, but they, they, they you know, they, they are a little bit more special than us ordinary folk. But you know, still, like you don't, most people don't think about Justin Bieber all day. In real life, there's no spotlight on you. You're not that special, because you know, again, especially if you're like a young teenager, teenager or young kid, it feels, it does feel like. You're on a stage and everyone's judging you and assessing you and f carefully focusing in on you and looking at you and meticulously kind of critiquing you and thinking about you all the time and stuff like this. This is complete nonsense. Again, in real life, there is no spotlight. You're not special. You can go outside, walk around some type of city center area that you might have, I don't know. Whatever type, like whatever country you're in, there has to be like some type of city center area. I know in England, in Birmingham, you know, the bull rings is, is there and stuff. You can go around there and stuff and walk around in the bull ring, or you might be in some other countries. Like if you, you can go around the city center and stuff, nobody's gonna focus on you. Nobody's gonna care about you, man. You know, this is uh, this actually, um, I was, when I was in the city center actually with my brother and stuff, I, I actually there was some, there was this, I don't know if this, if this guy was, um, some type of um, transsexual person, or if he was gay, or something, or some, or something similar, whatever. He was wearing like some type of dress, and he was walking in around the city center, around the bowling area, in a dress, which is hilarious. But nobody cared. That's so bizarre. Nobody cared, even though there was this like guy. He was wearing like a, a dress. It was very brightly colored and stuff like that. Everybody, it's very noticeable, but nobody cared. Nobody bothered him or anything. To my, at least from what I saw. I mean, maybe someone else bothered him when he was in some other type of location, I don't know. But when he was walking around the city center, nobody cared about it. cared about this guy, this guy that was literally wearing some type of anime dress, a very brightly colored, very brightly colored women's clothing. This guy was wearing it. Nobody cared. He, he looked ridiculous, but nobody cared. Really goes to show you right, that nobody cares about you in any meaningful way. Think about it, think about it. Do you, like as a, as a, as a person, do you think about anyone else for more than for more than five minutes? tops for more than five minutes tops think about it any type of um like anyone do you think about any type of person for more than five minutes typically we don't even think about ourselves for like one minute you know do you think about any specific person for more than five minutes obviously you might be romantically attracted to someone or you might have some special interest in someone and then they're on your head a lot but i don't know in my opinion i believe that a lot of us we only think about like ourselves mostly mostly our own lives. We don't focus too much on other people and you don't tend to think about other people too much unless there's like something going on, like your one of your family members is ill or something like that, I don't know. You know, celebrities, you know, Justin Bieber, do you think about Justin Bieber a lot? No, you don't. Do you think about any other type of major celebrity a lot? No, you don't. You only think about your own life and your own problems and that's just like, you know, when you're when you're when you're walking down the street outside, you know, do you pay attention to anyone that's alongside you, that any other type of person that's walking around the city center along with you? No, you don't. You focus on yourself. You look at your own life and stuff. You focus on how you're going to go to where you want to go. You don't focus on anyone else when you're in the city center or when you're outside or in some type of public area. You don't focus on anyone else. Why, why would you assume that it would be any different for you? Why would you assume that other people would be caring about you? Like, think about it. Do you think about other people a lot? I'm kind of mumbling with my words and I'm all over the place, but think about it. Do you do you pay attention to other people and their habits? No, you don't. Typically, we tend to think about our own lives and our own problems. And you know, this is kind of this, and and this is um this this kind of this is um this relates to so many different things, right? That you know, you're not special. You're not you know. There's no spotlight in real life on you. There, again, when we're young, we, it feels like we're on a, there's like a stage and we're, we're all on, we're, we're not all of us, but you might, as a person, as an individual, you're like on a stage and other people are judging you and meticulously caring about you and focusing on, on who you are and like what you do and stuff like that. And they, they, they're so concerned about you. This is all nonsense again. Again, in real life, there is no spotlight. There is no stage. Nobody cares about you. You're not special. You know, when you're in, again, the city center area, like as you, I'm talking about you, you, focus on other people that are walking around the city center would you no you don't you don't focus on anyone else but yourself you only focus on on where you're going what you're doing and stuff like that your own personal um interests and agendas you don't focus on anyone else 
And that's so true. That's true for you as well. The other people, they don't care about you. Just like how you don't care about them. They don't care about you, man. You're not special. The world doesn't care about us. Stuff. We're not, us individuals, we're not special or important. This is all. This is so important, man. This is something you have to grasp. Again, when again when you're young, maybe I don't know. It you do, it, it does feel like you're on a stage, and other people they're so they care about you. They care about what you're doing and stuff like this. What you're up to and stuff. What you're doing, your habits and your um your behavior and stuff like this and how you look. When you're when you're very young, it does feel like you're on a stage and people are they're constantly judging you and stuff like this. But you know, that's just nonsense again. Nobody cares about you. You're not special. There is no spotlight in real life. There's no um stage that you're on that people are going to judge you from and stuff like that. There's none of this stuff. You're not special. You're not important. This is so important. This is so like this is so important. Like, you must understand this. Right? This is so important. Again, even celebrities, Justin Bieber. People will say, well, what about celebrities and stuff? Okay, Justin Bieber. Obviously, people are gonna have a clue about who this guy is. He might get harassed a lot in in public areas and stuff. I don't know. But still, you don't. Do you think about Justin Bieber all the time? No, you don't. Even like, I, I, okay, I would assume like that because Justin Bieber probably has a lot of different fans. Even his fans, they, they cannot. I don't unless they're I, obviously. I might be wrong in this regard. I don't know. Maybe there is some person that's so obsessed with Justin Bieber that he just he or she thinks about Justin Bieber all the time. Okay, but you know, most people that know about Justin Bieber and his music, they don't think, really think about Justin Bieber too much. He's not on their mind too much. You know what I mean? That's so even Justin Bieber is not that special, and even these other major celebrities are not that special. Oh, obviously, of all you know, compared to us ordinary folk, they are a little bit more special. But I don't know, they're not. They're still like not that special. That's where you gotta understand. Where, where as individuals, we're not special, man. Do you think about any other type of? Per obviously, you might be thinking about family members and close associates, and maybe you might be thinking about someone that you're romantically attracted to, or you might have some special interest in. Do you think about like? Typically, do you think about someone else a lot? Is someone else on your mind a lot? Maybe I'm being kind of stupid because, you know, people, like, if you're romantically attracted to someone, maybe that might be different. And, or if you might care about someone else to, to such an extent, that might be different. But typically, we, we usually only care about ourselves and our own lives and our own problems and issues and stuff like this. Other people, they only, they only take up a small part of our mental space, right? You know what I mean? We don't think, like... You have to agree with me, right? But you don't. Do you really think about someone else to such a massive extent that he, he or she's always on your head, always on your mind, always in your head, and stuff like this? Of course not. Again, this likewise. You know, other people they don't think about you at all or care about you at all. Again, the city center. If you're in the city center, you can walk around there. Nobody's gonna care about you. Nobody thinks about you. Nobody's gonna look at you twice. This is so. It's kind of um, somewhat sad, but it's just the, it's like an unfortunate reality, right? You could go to the city center area, walk around there, and stuff. Nobody's gonna care about you at all. Again, I was with my brother and stuff, and we were in the city center, and yo, and there was this um, there was this guy. I don't know if he was a homosexual or some transsexual person. He was wearing a dress, and he was just going down the city center bouldering area and stuff. Blah blah blah. Nobody batted an eyelid at him. Obviously, maybe I'm kind of being dumb. Maybe some people were giving him like some like looks like that. You know, like you know when someone's doing something weird, you kind of look at him like that. People, they were giving him, they, they could have, they might have looked at him in a kind of slight weird way, but nobody was like harassing him or, or, or trying to talk to him or anything like that. So, you know, again, you're not, you're not special, man. We're not, none of us individuals are not that important and special. There's no spotlight on us in real life, you know what I mean? It feel, again, it feels so, it does feel like you're on a stage and people are judging you and assessing you, critiquing you, looking at you, thinking about you all the time. That's not true, man. People, they only care about their own lives. Just like how you only care about your own lives. I, Your own life, not lives. Your own life. I'm being stupid now. Unless you're, I don't know. Your own life. Like Just like how you only care about your own life. Again, do you think about other people a lot? No, you don't. Do you think about other people a lot? Are other people on your mind a lot? No, they aren't. You you. We only tend to think about ourselves. We only care about ourselves. The human being is um, selfish, naturally selfish. We're naturally uh, selfish. We're naturally shallow. We're naturally superficial as well, right? We're, but these things are true for the human being. Right? We, we are selfish. We care about ourselves. A lot of you are gonna be like, you're gonna disagree. No, I'm not selfish. I'm not selfish. Of course you're selfish, right? If there was like some type of um, zombie apocalypse and there was like and food was very scarce, and let's just say there was like one, there was like one piece of orange, and one cup of water, 
and it, you could only you can only sh like and there was like hundreds of other people that were that were gonna grab this and we're, we're looking for this and stuff would you like share your one cup of water and one piece of orange with these hundreds of other people in a zombie apocalypse of course you wouldn't unless you want to die unless you want to die unless you want to die or, or unless you want to be uncomfortable or unless you're some type of um Unless you're you, you're like some type of hippie guy or or hippie. I don't know. You know what I mean by hippie. Um, you you wanna you wanna like I don't know. Unless you're maybe I'm being kind of stupid. But again, picture imagine a zombie apocalypse. There's one piece of orange, one cup of water. And there's hundreds of strangers that are, that, are, that, are, that, are, that want this. But you, you you and and then there's your own family and brothers and sisters and mother and father and stuff. Who are you gonna give this cup of water, one piece of? Cup, one one cup of water and one piece of orange too. Of course, a lot of people are gonna say a lot of people, a lot of stupid people are gonna be like, no, I'll just share it with hundreds of strangers that I don't really care about. Of course not. You're gonna focus on your own family and and yourself and stuff. You're gonna be selfish and you're gonna take this one piece of orange and cup of water and you're gonna distribute it to the, to the people that are close to you and stuff like that, or maybe just to yourself. You're not gonna care about the strangers. Man. Human beings, we are natural. When we are naturally selfish, we only care and think about ourselves typically and usually, usually. We don't tend or care. To, we don't think about other people too much, man. This is so true. We, the human being, is naturally selfish. When you're outside in the city center area, <coughs> the people <coughs> you might be in a city center area. People like there's hundreds of strangers are in the city center with you and stuff. They're selfish. They don't think about you. They only think about themselves. It must be understood that the human being is selfish. We are selfish creatures. Um, again, there's a zombie apocalypse. There's only one piece of orange. There's one piece of orange and there's one cup of water. One cup of water. water. I don't know why I'm doing this with my hands. There's one piece of orange and one cup of water and there's hundreds of strangers and then there's your own family and stuff. Obviously, okay, a lot of you might be stupid and say, oh no, I'll just share this one piece of orange and cup of water with hundreds of strangers. Okay, to you, if, you, if you want to be stupid then, Fair enough, but it's like, come on, it's common sense that you're gonna share this one piece of orange and cup of water with your own family and yourself. You're gonna be selfish. We, the human being, is selfish. We only care about ourselves. Right? You know, and obviously this relates back to the topic, the topic at hand. You know, you're not special, right? The world doesn't care about you. Other people, they don't really care about you that much. That's you have to understand this, man. If you don't understand this, you're gonna experience a lot of difficulties in life. All right. You're not special, man. If, again, it feels like we're on a stage. Everyone's judging us and looking at us and paying attention to us and careful, carefully analyzing us and meticulously focusing on us and thinking about us. Obviously, you know, this is just nonsense. You're not special. You know, other people, they, they, they don't care about you. They're thinking about themselves. They're, they're, other people, they're only concerned with, with themselves and their own lives. They don't think about you at all. We're not special, man. We're not, us individuals, we're not special. Even celebrities, I mean, Justin Bieber, most people don't think about him too much, you know what I mean? Again, we're not special, man. We're not special. The human being, again, is the human being is naturally selfish. Again, in a zombie apocalypse, there's one piece of orange and one cup of water. Are you going to share this one piece of orange and cup of water with hundreds of strangers, or are you going to obviously, you're, or, or are you going to like the common sense approach will be that you just give it to your own family and to yourself? You, you obviously, a lot of people are going to be like, no, 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 no. I'll share it with the hundreds of strangers. No, you won't. And again, this is it's the, like, this one cup of water and this one piece of orange. These are the only food. This is the only food available. You, a lot, don't be stupid. You won't. A lot of you, some people might be like dumbasses and say, oh, I'll come back at me and say, oh no, I'll share this one piece of orange and one cup of water with hundreds of strangers in a zombie apocalypse. You have to remember this is the only food available. Of course you wouldn't share it at all. You would be selfish. You would give it to yourself and your family members. The human being is naturally selfish. We only care and think about ourselves. You're not special. Again, us, as individuals, we're not special. You go outside and walk around people, they're, they're not going to think twice about you, man. They're not going to think, they're not going to think or care about you too much to such a large extent. That's so true. That's facts, man. As a young man or woman, you have to understand that nobody truly cares about you. That's so important for you. I must, you must understand this. This is so important that you're not special. Nobody thinks about you too much. Nobody cares about you too much. Nobody even kind of pays attention to you too much. You're literally, as an individual, you're like, you're, you're as irrelevant as dust as an individual. That's how irrelevant you are. You know, when you're in a room, you, obviously dust is everywhere, but you don't really think about dust too much, right? That's how irrelevant you are as an individual. We're not, we're not special, man. We're, you're not special. I'm not special. We're not special. 
you know, again, you're outside, you're in the city center. It feels, it feels like people, they care about you to such a, lo- a large extent. It feels like people care about you a lot. They pay attention to you a lot. They focus on you a lot. This is all. Damn, my camera got too hot and it kind of shut off. Again, you're not special. It feels again like people, they care like when you're in this, you might be out in the city center or somewhere else outside. It feels like other people, they care about you a lot. They think about you a lot. They focus on you a lot. They think too much about you or they care too much about you or something like this. This is all just nonsense. You're not special, man. You're not special. I'm not special. No, like us individuals, we're not special. You have to understand this. This is so important that you're not special. Nobody cares about you too much. Nobody thinks about you too much. Nobody even focuses on you too much. You're not special. I'm not special. Us individuals, we're not special. You're not special. That's so important to understand. You're not special, man. Nobody thinks about you too much. Nobody cares about you too much. Nobody focuses on you too much. That's so important, man, to to grasp and understand.